get started right now. Honest trailer, aliens. <laughs> From James Cameron, before he got obsessed with blue people ponytail sex, comes a brilliantly simple plan to make Alien even better. Make it plural. Aliens. Before you see the sequel to whatever Prometheus was about, revisit a sequel that wasn't necessarily better than the original, but it damn sure was bigger. Yellier. We are leaving! And ten times more boomier. Can't move. One of my favorites. You know, this worked because they twisted a horror film into a war movie. But every other action franchise just figured good sequel means loud noises. Whoa! Return to the grimy, sweaty truck stop bathroom that is the <laughs> alien universe. Stop, Nobody touched nothing. And dust off your undies to salute your dad's oh, first nice crush, one. Ripley. She's back in action after taking out an alien single-handedly. And still no one listens to a thing she has to say. I'm telling you that those things exist. Thank exist. you, Officer Ripley, that will be all. Are you listening? Listen to me. Just one of those things managed to wipe out my entire crew. Yeah, okay, right. Do it now! Shut up! <laughs> But Ripley's not alone. She's riding with the Colonial Space Marines. They may not be all that brave. Do something! Not that in shape. <coughs> Don't have the best discipline. <laughs> and are more than a little bit creepy sometimes. There's some juicy colonist daughters we have to rescue from <laughs> the <opportunity. laughs> But, uh, that big it gun is. is pretty sweet. <laughs> Meet side characters who rise above being disposable alien bait, like Hicks, the grease-painted soldier in all your favorite movies. Vasquez, a master of disguise, cleverly pretending to be Latino. That's messed up. <laughs> <laughs> when they finish putting the first-class people in the world, they're starting with us. Yep, same person. And Bill That's Paxton Hudson, the Marine who literally can't even. This can't be happening, man. How could they cut the power, man? They're animals. I watched that. What the f are we supposed to do? We're not going to last 17 One hours. One of the best parts of the movie. Game over, man. Game over, game dude. R.I.P. B-Pax. It's never game over, man. Together, they'll take on the nastiest monster in the galaxy. Corporate middle managers. Right. This installation has a substantial dollar value attached to it. And also some xenomorphs. Perfect killing machines who can only be defeated by big ass futuristic guns. Assault rifles. Fire. Tiny little shotguns. Handguns. Or extra slow robot punches. <laughs> But man, do they look scary. It's like a sex toy factory made out of scorpions. So strap in with one of the greatest sci-fi movies yes. of all time that took all the cool stuff from the original, like crawling through ducks, milky yeah. robots, and uh, the exact same ending. Then added freaking mechs and a Batmobile. Yes. <laughs> Cause even if you're making a brutally dark sci-fi movie for adults, you still gotta sell a few toys. Yeah. And in the ultimate space marine, Max, disguised in his big bad bug suit. And that's still a better story than Prometheus. Starring the talented Ellen Ripley. Hey, Hixie, you so fine. The garbage mm -hmm. pale kid. Mad, Mad about, about you. you. I'm the Pax man. Be up, 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 up. See Creepio, my favorite Twitch channel, Yas Queen, and the most badass moment in sci-fi <laughs> history. Get away from her, you bitch! <laughs> Woo! Aliens. Yep, that actually sums it up pretty good. Very good, very nice, very funny. Ripley, I got one question for you. What are those? What are those? And that shoe actually man. did come out. Game over. Very, very awesome, guys. Very, very funny stuff, guys.